This video is proudly sponsored by Readly, but more on that and details of a special offer later on. Hi everybody, hope you are well. Now last year was, well obviously quite the year, and we spent many holidays away for just a few nights, like two or three nights away. And in those breaks we thought to ourselves it wasn't really worthwhile us putting up an awning. So instead we opted for the canopy route, and the canopy we were using was the Eclipse, which is the canopy off of our Magnum 400 from Isabella. And it worked out really, really well. We enjoyed it, in fact. It was very easy to put up, very easy to give us a bit of shelter from the sun. It also kept the rain off of us and also gave the dog an area to eat his food without getting dribbled on. So canopies are the future, certainly for us if we're spending a couple of nights away. Now this year, Isabella are launching three brand new canopies and I thought I would share those with you today. So I've been on the blower, I've asked Nathan to pop down and spend the day with me, and we're gonna show you the three brand new canopies for 2021. So this is third time's the charm that we've tried to film this. It is. Snow, wind, and today, rain. No sun for the sun canopies. No sun for the sun canopies, but it does actually bring a really good point up. That is, we used our sun canopy last year mostly to keep the rain off of the dog. And I think that's the point, isn't it? It's not really just for sun. It's literally just to give you an indoor outdoor space. It is, especially for the dogs and everything like that, your wet shoes that you don't want in the van. Yeah. Anything just to have out of the van covering anything. Yeah, okay. The canopies that you've brought with us today, what's the maximum length that they're gonna be on the rail? So the biggest one we've brought today is the four meter, just over okay. four meters. So ideally that will fit, I mean, that will fit on our van, no problem, because our yeah. awning is four meters long. So that's absolutely fine. And the good thing with sun canopies, you haven't got to miss windows and lockers or anything like that because it's just on the top. So you can pretty much go for as big as, you, as the van dictates. Yeah, yeah, sure. And genuinely, it's a one person operation, isn't it? You don't need two people to do no, this. No. It's just one person. Definitely, okay. even for you. Even for me. Yeah. Thanks, mate. <laughs> well, you've brought three canopies along. What are we going to start with? We're going to start with the new Lodger, which I brought a three meter. So it's the new polled version. Okay. And uh, just as you're going to start, the wind's just started to pick up. It has. So this is going to be brilliant. So why don't you crack on and do that, and I'll just, uh, I'll go make myself a coffee. Yeah. See you later. So whilst I make a coffee and Nathan builds the Loggia 300, let me give you the specifications of this sun canopy. The width is 3 metres and the depth is 2.7 metres, and including the poles and pegs and canopy, it weighs just 5.8 kilograms. This Loggia 300 retails for 339. There is also a 4 metre length version, which also is 2.7 metres in depth and weighs 6.6 .6 kilograms. This 400 version retails for £391. Cheers. Cheers. It's alright, isn't it? It's not too bad. Um, why are all the poles at an angle? Yep, yeah, so for all of our sun canopies, well, majority, the shadow and now the lodger, so the, the bigger brother to the shadow, we'll always sl slightly angle it in just to give it that support and then it sort of goes with a guy rope to give it that strength. Okay, talk to me about the fabric which is here because this doesn't look like a normal Isabella fabric. No, so it's a lighter weight material, so it's 190 gram. Yeah. So it's our lightweight sun canopy material that we use all the time and that's what we want it for, nice and lightweight for you to put up carbon fibre frame yes. that goes with it, nice and lightweight as well. Okay. Um, and in the nice lightweight colour scheme. Right, okay. Now everything you need to put this up comes with the kit. So you get your fix on bracket, your yep. carbon fibre frame, the material, plenty of Typhoon storm straps. Yes. So you get extras as well for the middle and your pegs, your thin little metal pegs and your red plastic pegs. So you've got Brilliant. stuff for your feet and your guy ropes. Excellent. Um, rain management, if it rains, um, this one is gonna be really quite easy actually because the rain's gonna come off either side, isn't it? Yes. Be having that center roof pole will give you that natural angle. What we always say with any uh, sun canopy, you're going out for the day and you know there might be a bit of weather, you can slightly lower one leg anyway, just to give it a bit more of a runoff. Great, excellent. This is really nice, isn't it? What do you think of this? I think it is, there's a bit more to it than the shadow, but having that extra, the centre roof pile makes it easier. And we've been asked for many years for a deeper sun canopy. Right. The shadow is very good, but that's only two metres. So this just gives you that extra 70 centimetres. So that, it's perfect for that. Lovely. Right, okay. Um, I'm just gonna go and refill my cup because yeah. I've uh, mysteriously drunken all of this. And, uh, and then we'll go on to the next one. Yeah, do an air one. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. Trust me, as soon as lockdown is lifted and we can travel, I'm going to be sat outside this caravan in the glorious weather, having some much needed me time. And to make the whole experience a little bit better, I'm going to bring along my entire reading material. Handily, 
all available on my phone. Now Readly is a digital subscription service for magazines and all my favourite publications are in one handy digital location ready for me to read. I'm currently getting inspiration on destinations to visit later this year, recipe ideas and I'm catching up with the latest news and reviews in retro gaming. In fact there are over 5,000 titles ready and waiting for me to discover. The Readly app is free to download and available for phones and tablets. The app is really easy to use to both allow you to find your familiar titles but it also enables you to discover more publications. For instance international titles you may not be familiar with. Magazines can be downloaded to your device and used offline so you won't need any Wi-Fi and you won't need to use up any data. And helpfully you can set up more than one profile in the account so the entire family can benefit. So whilst I geek out with amateur radio, Angela can be getting the latest news on her soap operas and Chloe can carry on with her beloved Sudoku. Now personally I find it's great to have all my reading material in just one place. Not only to reduce the environmental impact that printing actually has but to also save the space in the caravan whilst we're away. I mean, can you imagine 5,000 titles in this caravan? That'd be ridiculous, wouldn't it? Now, for a very limited time, Readly have a special promotion. Readly is free for six weeks, and then just $7.99 a month thereafter. This offer is time limited, so don't miss out. And don't forget, Readly is contract free, so you can cancel it at any time. But don't take my word for it, sign up and give it a go yourself. I think you'll really enjoy it. Anyway, let's get back to the canopies, where Nathan is inflating the Isabella Air Arc. So back to the sun canopies. This is the Isabella Air Arc canopy and it measures up as 3.9 metres in width and 2.6 metres in depth. The weight of this canopy is 12.6 kilograms which includes the pumps, the pegs and the carry case. It retails for £927. Did you want a coffee by the way Nathan? No, you just look after yourself. All right. So let me get this right then. So this fabric here, I recognise the roof panel instantly. Yep. That's what we have in our Magnum, isn't it? Yep. Um, so if you, people who are unaware about this fabric type, let's just go through exactly what this fabric is. So it's polyester roof. Like you say, you'll find on your Magnum, we do do slightly different thicknesses. This is the 240 gram. So slightly different to some of our other sun canopies, which is 190. This is sort of in your middle grade. And you get the pattern roof as well on this model, similar to your Magnum. This uh, fabric on the outside here, this looks something very similar to the Cirrus. Exactly the same. Is it? So it's your acrylic material on the sides. Yeah. So it's breathable. It won't fade in the sunlight. Single inflation point. Yep. Um, we've got three roof beams here. Mm -hmm. um, and it's, now it's getting quite windy as well. The yep. wind has really picked up. And I can see that, okay, it's flapping around, but then that's indicative of all canopies. It is, yeah. But it's not moving at all. Nope. But we do have extra points here we can put some typhoon straps down at the back you've got them at the front here and on the sides we haven't done it today but yeah. like you say if the wind was getting a bit higher we could do it you've got yeah. your three pegging points there you can also peg underneath the tube so you've got the the sock or the sleeve underneath there you can peg that down as well just for extra security talk to me about this pump because this comes <coughs> with this canopy but there's something quite special about this and i don't think we've ever covered it on this channel okay so it's the same pump that comes with our serious air awning basically what you've actually got is two settings so you have actually got what we call the max setting so you see how the diameter of the tube there so it's actually harder to pump up but it makes the air only go up a lot quicker right then when you get close to the psi to the, the maximum that you require you'll, you'll find that you're really struggling or i am anyway but then you can change it to the slightly thinner setting mm -hmm. it just gets you that bit easier and gives it gets that last little bit of pressure into the tubes we always go double action big maximum just to get it up as quick as we can now I know that you also sell an electric pump as well. We do. My experience has been though, to get it up really quick, use a, one of these. 100%. And especially with that, with that system that we've got, I know for a fact I can get this up quicker with this pump rather than the electric pump. As a fit young man like what you are, how difficult is it to use that pump to get this uh, up? Don't get me wrong, you do start breathing a bit heavily towards the end. It depends how quickly you want to do it. I yeah. tend to use the maximum setting to get a load in really quick, pop the canopy up or the awning and then come back to the pump and just get that last little bit in. Lovely, lovely. I really like this, mate. Good. I really like this one. Um, now the next uh, canopy that we're gonna show is a little bit different. It is. Something special, something a bit eye-catching. Look really nice on this Bailey. Yeah. But see what you think. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to that. I'm gonna finish my drink and then gonna take a phone call. Yeah, okay, yeah. I'll, uh, do. I'll carry on with this. So yeah, 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 all right, cheers, pal. 
Now this is a very different sun canopy. This is the Isabella Air Y. Designed to fit caravans, motorhomes and campervans, it's truly a unique design. Its width is 3.6 metres, the depth is 2.4 metres and it weighs 9.5 kilograms. This sun canopy retails for £823. Do you know what? This is really deceiving. You like it now, don't you? I didn't like it when you were putting it up. No. Nah. I thought it was a ridiculous gimmick. To be honest, with the wind, I probably should have pegged those down first, but in that's hindsight, isn't it? Do you know what, though? It's a bit windy now. I mean, you won't be able to pick up on the mics, but it's got a bit windy, hasn't it? Yeah. And inside, it's lovely. Obviously, these you can adjust. So if it is quite windy, you could bring that sort of angle. Right down? Yeah. Or if it's really nice and you didn't want it, you could just put it even Put it up on out. the end of the van. Yeah. But what's really lovely is this. Yeah. Nice this, is, this is actually going to be perfect for the UK weather. For that little bit of bluster, that little bit of wind, Yeah. that's enough to just put it there. Like I say, we have got the sun. It, it looks like it wouldn't actually give you any sun protection. But as you can see, you're in the shade fully. Even if you're on a seat, you'll still be yeah. sat down and you're still in the shade. Yeah. Or if the sun is coming at a different angle, that's where these triangle wings come in into their own you can change it to do you know what this is this is really surprised because I, I just imagine this now is a lovely alfresco space because i would put my windbreak around here yeah got some chairs here we put our table out here for outdoor eating the grill over there from the barbecue you know the dog's got his place here or there yeah um you know for eating and drinking or what have you got a little cupboard down there so we can this is lovely Right, and there we go. There is three brand new canopies from Isabella for the 2021 season. Um, now, let me be honest with you. This thing here has really surprised me. It's left me a little bit speechless, to be honest with you, which is a dumbfounded Nathan. I was, a thought, I was thinking that this actually was a bit of a gimmick. I thought, who's going to want that? But actually, when you go inside and have a walk around with it, it's actually really pleasant. I don't think the pictures that they've put online about this thing have actually done it justice. So the question is, am I going to borrow this? Am I going to borrow the Ark? Or am I going to borrow the first one that we saw, which I can't remember the name of? Well, I've discounted that one already. It's between the Ark and the Y. I think we're going to go for the Ark. And I think in the summer, when we're going away with it, I'm going to do some pros and cons about using canopies, why you should, why you shouldn't, and if there's any benefits to them. So I'm going to do that in the summer whilst we are away for a cheeky weekend. And as you can probably tell, the wind has really gotten up right now. So left for me to do is to put this one down. Well, I say me put it down. I mean, we can let them put it down and uh, go and have another cup of coffee. So look, many thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, comments, or anything to say about these canopies, you know, put them in the comments down below. It's always lovely to see your feedback. So please subscribe to our channel, hit the notification icon on as well. And if you can do all of that, then we'll see you next time. Many thanks for watching guys. Take care now. Bye-bye.